touchdowns were flowing. The winds coming with ease. Mason Brang's senior season was going as good as he could have scripted it. Then midway through the second quarter of week three, the unthinkable. I mean, it's not how I envisioned my senior year going. In route to the end zone, Brang was brought down at the four yard line. He was unable to get back up. The senior quarterback broke his left leg. It was definitely hard to see him go down because I know how much work he's put in preparation and offseason and going through his senior year. Kind of lost a lot, you know. I was very emotional. Um, not gonna lie, I did cry. Felt like it just a, I got hit by a bus or something. Brang had surgery the following day. He would be out indefinitely. Without any guarantee that he would return to the playing field, he made sure to not skip a practice. He also attended every game. That was how I felt I needed to be a part of the team, and that kept that bond between me and my brothers out there. Uh, I just kept that bond between us. It definitely pushes a little bit harder just to know that he's still out here when he could be, you know, at home laying in bed or something. But um, the fact that he was still out here, it, it meant a lot to us. 68 days after going down, the words he didn't know if he'd hear were said. Mason Brang was cleared to play football again. Completely shocked. I mean, it was a blessing from God. Um, I never, I didn't know if I would be able to play for the rest of the season and uh, to hear that news, I mean, I was just smiling and ear to ear, and so, I mean, it was great to be back. I had a whole celebration dance, you know, I was very excited. Um, kind of like a sense of relief just to know that, you know, my quarterback's going to be back out here. He's been their quarterback for over the last 10 years is, is when they were Little League and all that. So, you know, it's just been it's been huge for the, the uplift of, you know, they want him to get back and have a chance to play with us, and it was huge for him. In the second round of the playoffs, Brang made his return to the playing field. 182 yards and a touchdown. The signal caller didn't miss a beat. Just coming down the stadium, getting to run out, getting to experience that feeling one more time. Um, I felt like I needed to settle in by getting hit one time, and so once that once that was over, I felt settled in, and so it was good. Battle tested, battle worn, but battled back to battle again. So went the senior season of Mason Brang. Reporting in South Knoxville, I'm Jordan Kramer, WATE Sports.